Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we're gonna have my lovely daughter do my makeup. Um, and she's gonna use her makeup, um, what she uses on herself, she's gonna use on me and see how it looks on me. So um, we're gonna go ahead and get started because I have a feeling this is gonna be really long. Um, so she wanted me to show you what I use on my face before I put makeup on. This isn't part of hers, this is my stuff. So I use this um, micellar water um, to get a clean canvas. And then I use this rose water toning spray. Um, this is my, my favorite. Any kind of toner, really. Um, can you not look so mad? <laughs> and then um, I use this as a spot treatment. It's a serum, but it really makes my breakouts go away like way faster and if I use it like on the spots where I get breakouts um they're like practically never there um but I hadn't used it for a while so I kind of broke out badly but it's getting better and then this is my favorite moisturizer right now it's by Garnier I can't really see it because it's a glass um bottle but it's called a moisture moisture rescue refreshing gel cream and it's like a pink gel and it's really, really, really moisturizing. And I have really dry skin. So anyway, Lexi, take it away. Okay, so this is my makeup bag. It's really big, but I got it for Christmas. And yeah, so I don't wear foundation because I don't really need it. And my face isn't like And we have crazy freckles everywhere. and we like to let our freckles yeah, I show like my through. Freckles. Um, so I just use a concealer, and this is the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind, um, and this is in Which the Which is my shade. favorite, too. Yeah, my mom uses this as well, but, yeah. This is in the shade Fair, or Claire, I'm not going to call it. Fair. <laughs> it says Fair Claire. Yeah, Claire's another language. But it doesn't look so much. Can you not roll, your, no more eye rolls in this video. Okay. So, turn around, look at me. Okay, ready? Mm-hmm. Close your eyes. Ugh. I don't put it on my nose because... Why do you put it so far down? Because I have really red cheeks. I just want to do. And I'm not putting on a foundation. So, I put it under my cheeks. I mean, under my eyes and on my cheeks. I put it on my chin, too, because I have a lot of stuff there. And, and then I just go on any blemishes. We got... And then any blemishes! <laughs> and then... I use the, I think this is by Real Techniques, mm -hmm. um, the makeup sponge, uh, but yeah, I got this at Walgreens, and yeah, so I wet it, because that's what you're supposed to do, and then I just put it all out. Where is it? Do it. Oh, no, I do. Wake up. Wake up. Ooh. What? What was that? Oh, yeah. My setting powder is really old, and it's like, you can just see, like, the ends of it, like, just a little bit more. And this is, like, totally the old, hand. yeah, the old, uh, True Match, and this is the Classic Ivory. I don't know, I think this is I need to use some more powder. Yeah, and this is my new brush set. I have, all of them look like this. They're by Sonia something. Sonia Cashing. Yeah, and these, that was a brush set of ten of them, got it at Target, Aren't they and pretty? they were 40 bucks. But I got them with my gift cards I got for Christmas. So I just put this on the places that I put concealer. So I put it on my chin and on my cheeks. And then I put it right here because that's where I do it. But just anywhere where I put concealer. Like in the T-zone. Yeah. Where you get breakouts and stuff. Where you put the, where you want the most coverage. Yeah, but I don't put any concealer on my nose because I get like blackheads on there. And if I do, then it, like, looks really cakey. So, I don't put anything on my nose, but, I mean. That's yeah. why it's important to get a concealer that matches the color of your skin. Yeah. And then, okay. The next thing I do is I contour my face. And this is by the Color Workshop. Like, I got this in a big set by for Cover Christmas. Girl? Oh, no. Color Workshop. The Color Workshop. And this is a four contour thing. This one broke, so it, well, not a learning more. It was, like, a glittery color. But this is the color that I use. And then... I use the contour brush from that same set and take a little bit, tap off the excess, and then make a buff face like, okay. I just contour my cheekbones. I don't do my jaw or anything 
like other than that because I mean I don't really I'm not that good at it and I don't want to mess up before I go to school so I'm going to take my big brush and blend anything out if I need to okay and since we're pale we need to definitely blend oh yeah really good is that blend is that good I think so yeah it looks pretty good because then I looked very um what's the word like chiseled yeah you know like yeah and I don't necessarily have like an actual highlighter so I use this very shimmery eyeshadow it's almost gone but it's by pop goes the shadow and it's in the color by pop goes the, whatever that's the name of the eyeshadow and it's in the shade or color champagne, champagne yeah and then I use the I don't know if it's technically a highlighter brush but it it's definitely it for highlighting. A and I just take a little bit on there. Look at me. Look at me. And I just, I usually just highlight on my hair, whatever you want to call that. The cheekbones. And then I do a little bit like on the middle of my chin, right here, on the end of my nose. What about right here? I don't, I use a different brush for that later on. Um, like a smaller one. Because then. I use sorry, this brush right here, um, that's a really small, like, pointed, almost like a cone one, and I use the same stuff right here, and I put it, like, on your, what is that called? Cupid's bow. Cupid's bow. And then I use a different, um, set, it's by Sweet and Shimmer, it's like an eyeshadow palette, and it looks like, like, jewels, like that, but, um, yeah, and I, I use... That. I got this for Christmas from Brick's mom. And I use the middle color. The other ones are like, I don't know. I don't use this as eyeshadow. I use this to highlight the inner corner of my eyeball. And I just put a little bit there because I do it again later in my eyeshadow. So, yeah. So, I'm going to do eyeshadow. And I have the, um, this is like almost gone. But this is the um, CoverGirl True Naked. This is the Nudes palette. And this is what it looks like. Obviously, this is my favorite color, but it's almost gone. So, I'm using this flat one and this, like, pink color right here. And put it all over the eyelid. You're getting too quiet. They have to be able to All over the it. eyelid. Okay. Then I take a more thin brush like this. And I use this color. It's like almost gone. It's like a light brown. And open your eyes. And I put it in the crease. Open your eyes. I can't open my eyes while you're putting eyeshadow on me. Okay, whatever. And then I take the same brush that I used to put on the light color to just blend it all out. And then I take the same brush that I used for the crease and I take a tiny bit of this dark chocolatey brown color. It's like a tiny bit. And I tap it off a lot because it's pretty too dramatic. And I put it like kind of on her lash line or on my lash line. And then I guess like the outer V or like outer C of your eyeball and your eyelid, I mean, and just a little bit. And I keep it natural with my eyeshadow because I don't need to have it over the top crazy. I'm going to take the same brush and blend everything out. Look at me. Okay. And then, I can see it there. Quit throwing all your makeup all over my bed. You're going to get it oh dirty. Gosh, I'm going to take my concealer and go like right here just so that it looks the lines are clean. Clean, yeah. And then blend it out. Okay. Then I take this same step. I'm just doing the same step that I did earlier with the um like highlighting the inner part of your eye but yeah just do it again 
and a little bit more. Okay. Then I move on do... my brows. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I look weird without my brows. Though. So the stuff I do from the stuff I use for my eyebrows is the Maybelline Brow Show Define it. and Fill Duo. So this side is like a sponge and it like has like brow powder in it, I guess. And then um, this side is the pencil. So my color that I use is I think this is like auburn. No, soft brown. Oh yeah, brown, soft brown, lightest color brown. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Don't fuck. Oh, this is so different. Doing on somebody else. Okay. Don't. I don't like them too dramatic. Oh gosh, this is so scary. Okay. Oh gosh. Um, I'm so scared. So my eyebrows are really like thick at the right, like right here, but at the ends they get way more like yeah then sparse and so i just like fill the end of my eyebrows in i don't like mess with like the beginning or top of my brows whatever you can call them because i don't want them to like look really boxed in i don't look bad no okay and this is another spoolie isn't this awesome i don't know i don't just press god that. you dork stop and so i'm gonna just spoolie it out and then I use the pencil and my brows, they stop. Like, I don't know. They don't, don't make them too much longer. I'm not, Mom. I'm not even going away from your eyebrows where your hairs are. The spooling that gets rid of like 80% of the product. <laughs> How's that look? Good. Okay. So, eyebrows. <clears throat> and then, so. Speed it up. Okay. So. No, I, I don't want to even put that I, I usually use this, but sometimes I don't. But this is the Too Faced Lip Injections it Extreme. Hurts. does hurt really bad. Don't put it on me. I'm not. But it's like, it's a lip plumping stuff. Sometimes I do it if I'm feeling very brave. And um, so I use um, like a matte liquid lipstick. And these are the two that I usually use. This is the NYX Lingerie Color in Baby Doll. And that's this one, the top one right there. And then this is the Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Color. And this is in the color um, HD Embrace. But, <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. And that's the color right here, but it's kind of faded. But that's the color I'm wearing right now. And for Mom, I'm going to be doing the um, NYX Lingerie. And so that's my favorite. Yeah. And then I want to use my lip gloss. Can I? First? Or after? No, after. Okay. Um, <laughs> but um, with this one, like I heard a lot of really good things about it. That's why I started using it. But you have to like Come exfoliate on. the crap out of your lips so that it, cause it like shows every little crack and crevice in your lips. Go like this. Ah. Uh. Uh, such a weird applicator. It's so weird having someone else do it. Stop talking then. Okay. One and another. This one has a really weird consistency. Look at me. Open now. Okay. Mm -hmm. That one's in the shade Baby Doll, by the way. And then, um. And then I'm using my lip gloss. Yeah, what is that? I've it's called Vintage by Jessica Liebenskeen. I don't know. I got it in one of my Ipsy bags. You can't really. There, wait, there you go. Kinda. Okay, so no, what? the last thing I do is, um, well, second to last thing I do, is my mascara, and I use oh, two crap. mascaras. What? I'm scared for you to do my mascara. 
I've done it before. Okay. okay, so the first thing I do is the Organic Wear by Physicians Formula. I think they only sell this at Target, but, uh, yeah. So no, they sell it at Walmart, too. Oh. Well, I've only seen it at Target. But um, this stuff smudges really bad, so on top of it, I use Can the... you not use this on me? Can you just use this on me? But this one works better underneath it. It really does. I don't want it. <sighs> but then it's not the full effect. I don't want it on me. So what? Whatever. So then I guess I'm just going to use the CoverGirl Clump Crusher. That's my favorite. Um, wa it's, this is the waterproof one. but um, Why would you not get waterproof? I don't know. But for this brush. Unless you're like strong and you don't cry like me. But I cry like all the time. <laughs> okay. Well, um, so I like the uh. brush of this one. But I like the way this brushes it's like fanned out at the end it gets really good volume at the end of your eyelashes so i use this one in this product after i put a coat of this one on you're weird i also have really nice eyelashes okay blink can i just do my own whatever it's just like weird to have someone else put mascara on you why do you do it in the camera mom where else am i gonna do it I don't know. do you have a mirror not with me right now. I do on the dresser. Go get it. It's the little Kanique one. I'll just get mine. Mine's not good enough for her. Look how good it looks on my eyelashes. Do I need to see the other one too? No. No, the other brush? No. This is my favorite. Oh my gosh, I did not use that much. Well, I do. I like to see the glasses. I just want to Good, right? Okay. Hold it right here. I don't put on my black lashes. I used to not, but then I started again and I like how it looks. It just makes my eyes look more open. Yeah, I used to, and I used to put a lot on it. And I think and it looks really smokes. girly. I think it looks really girly. Yeah, but this one is waterproof. It's not going to go anywhere. I really like that on the inner corner. Yeah. I think she did a good job, guys. What do you think? Back it up. Look at me. Yeah. I don't know how to do brows, though, because we have very different brow shapes. They look good, though. I usually do a little more on the inside, but I think it looks fine. It looks natural. Okay, so give this video a thumbs up if you like it, and you like seeing Lexi on my channel. Um, Who doesn't like seeing me on the channel? I'm great. And subscribe to my channel if you're new. Um, I put out new videos at least once a week, sometimes two times a week, sometimes a little more. Um, but it's always at least once a week, and um, they're always different kind of videos. I think I'm going to do a yearly favorites. Thumbs up this video if you want to see that. I'm going to use my perfume too. Sure. Okay, so my perfume is the uh, pink, is warm and cozy by pink, and it's the body mist. Ready? Wait, do you want to do it? Yeah. Okay. I'm obsessed with this stuff. It does smell really good. I also have Hollister. It's pure Cali, but I don't have it in my makeup bag. She's such a show off. Stop. But, yeah. Anyway, so now we're going to go finish cleaning the house because we're having people over. Or I'm having people over um, Sunday night. My sisters are all coming over. So, I need to clean my house. Why didn't I know that? Because it's just for sisters. Okay. Um, you might be able to come, though. I don't know. Okay. Um, but anyway, we'll see you guys in our next video. Or my next video. She might be there. She's there sometimes. You did the eye roll again. I didn't eye roll. You did. <laughs> it was on camera. Okay. You did. You do it so much that you do it without even noticing. That's, That's bad. Okay, well, we'll see you guys. Bye.